again to another class of English, the language for class 4. Today we will be doing question number 3 and we will be rewriting our sentences after removing although and using but. In the previous question I explained that although and but mean the same. It means in spite of or iske bawajood. So when an example is given, for example if I say I was told to go to class but I went out to play. Then instead of being but instead of being in the class, what did I do? I went out to play. Iske baujub, I went out to play. So let us have a look at the first example. Although he was hungry, comma, he could not eat anything. So being very hungry, he was extremely hungry. But what happened? He could not eat anything. So what do I do? I remove although and instead of the comma, I place but. So let's have a look at the answer. He was hungry but he could not eat anything. So in spite of being hungry, he could not eat anything. Let's have a look at the second example. Although it was hot, she wore a thick coat. Now everyone knows we wear warm clothes or thick coats mainly in winter. But it was very hot. But what did she do? In spite of it being very hot, what did she do? She wore a thick coat. So let's have a look at the answer. It was hot, but she wore a thick coat. So where did this but come from? It, we removed the comma and placed a but. And we removed although. So I hope children, you have learned how to do this exercise. Thank you.